Hi guys, I'm Ashish from Guiding Tech and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can get an iOS like do not disturb feature or we also call it as the DND feature on your Android smartphone. So let's get started and see how that's done. Now the do not disturb feature is a built-in uh, feature of the Android uh, of the iOS uh, device and using this particular feature uh, you can actually uh, silence the incoming calls at a specific time so that you're not disturbed. Now there is a feature to allow uh, repetitive calls if there is an emergency uh, if somebody is trying to reach you in case of emergency other than that you can also select your favorite calls where you uh, which you don't want to um, silent anytime so that is a feature of iOS now let's see how you can uh, get this feature on your Android using a simple app called the Nights Keeper now the Nights Keeper can be uh, installed from the Play Store and it is a free app so once you have uh, installed the app you can go ahead and launch it let me just have a quick search where it is okay so this is how the uh, home screen of Nights Keeper will look like uh, once you have installed it so it will already have some predefined uh, schedule that is your 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. that's like the normal time of uh, when we go to sleep and wake up uh, other one is uh, exclusively for the weekend and uh, next one is uh, you can how you can choose how to uh, control this for once or twice in a week okay so uh, but the very first is like infinite do not disturb uh, which when turned on it will exclusively silent all the incoming calls no matter what time of the day or week it is now if you want to add an additional uh, time you can just uh, click on the add button and then uh, give a description that uh, might be the profile name of the profile type now here is the start time and the end time like when, when you want to start the scheduling of the uh, silencing of the incoming call and when you want to end it here's the repeat dates and uh, like the sound profile that it should be silent and uh, you can also mute the media sounds from the games or other apps that you have so which is a very good feature uh, indeed so if you are uh, playing your games at night uh, somebody who is sleeping with you will not be uh, disturbed by it the next thing is the call filtering mode now in this mode uh, you can actually add your favorite contacts uh, such in your uh, your wife your dad or any other whom you don't want to miss out on any time even if the feature is turned on so yes you can add your whitelist contacts over here and uh, you can also send uh, SMS notification uh, when you have uh, missed a call or rejected any of the call now the next uh, thing is um, emergency call it will uh, recognize several missed calls of an incoming call like two three four and if after three missed calls it will not silence the fourth missed call which means there is an emergency and the person is trying to reach you so yes there's a call for you okay after that uh, there are some pro features uh, such as the uh, power saver auto sync and the mobile network and the Wi-Fi now you can use this feature to save your battery while you uh, while the phone is in do not disturb mode and you don't actually use it it's just lying down uh, there beside your desk so uh, this pre feature is a uh, pro feature and you can uh, buy it from an in-app purchase now using the auto sync the mobile network and Wi-Fi as I already mentioned uh, it can be uh, used to save the battery and once the profile shuts down you can actually have the auto sync and everything on turn on back again so that was uh, pretty much everything uh, that was there about the night keeper now the app is uh, really simple to use and uh, it does not come with any limitations of uh, once you have the pro version installed on your device so that was everything about the night keeper if you have any doubts don't forget to ask them in the comment section if you like the video don't forget to press the thumbs up button and do subscribe to our channel if you haven't already thank you for watching